Welcome back. I'm now joined in studio by two very special guests from a very new organization that seeks to make a difference here in Essex County. Ruth Kleiman, the director of Lighthouse Social Services, and Linda Combs, the clinical director at the organization. Thank you both for joining us tonight. Thank you, Matt, for having us. And it was a pleasure for us to introduce our new agency, Lighthouse Social Services, located in Orange, New Jersey, that we are focusing in programs that will make a difference within the family uh, in, in our in our county. It's so important. Uh, October, Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Mm -hmm. uh, but this is a battle that we wage every single day, 365 days a year. And, and Linda, you're on the front lines. And the prevalence of domestic violence, it seems to be growing, is it not? Um, it's hard to say that it's absolutely growing. I think around the holidays we see a great deal more. But And let me just go back to definition of domestic violence. It's where there's intimate partner relationships, where power and control is being used. Uh, and often in emotional, physical, psychological, financial controls. Um, around the holidays, we are probably going to see more uh, because there's a great deal more stress. And of course, the power and control issues become more prevalent around the stressors, financial and otherwise. Um, and I'd like to say that we domestic violence cuts across all lines, whether it's economic, cultural, so it can be CEOs of major companies, it can be police officers, judges, doctors, um, as well as bricklayers. You know, we tend to think that domestic violence occurs only with the financially indigent. It doesn't. Power and control is a major issue across all boundaries and does occur about every 16 minutes is reported. That doesn't reflect the unreported, which is probably closer to five to eight minutes apart. Wow. And Ruth, I know the, really the, the genesis of, of Lighthouse sought to situate itself in a community that is largely underserved with these services. Mm -hmm. and, and this is a community, you know, Orange, in parts of Essex County that are on the macro level in New Jersey. There's a lot of them. It's not just Orange. Right. Uh, there's suburban areas and there's urban areas. Your organization, this organization, seeks to really kind of bridge the gap, may, you know, take away some of these barriers to entry. How is Lighthouse going to do that when it gets going? Well, we located in Orange because uh, uh, we know that there's a big Latino population and because of the majority of them, have uh, they are undocumented, so they cannot access or they are afraid to access services or report incidents of domestic violence. But we are focusing not only in giving the counseling sessions in Spanish, but also knowing their culture. Because for every leader issue of every person who comes from different countries, you have to be sensitive enough how to approach those issues to make it successful. Well, both of you, thank you so much. Uh, you're great. really doing a great service uh, for a lot of people. Hopefully, we're going to put the number up there as well as your website so people Good. can really tap into it and they can really reach out to you if they do need some services. And we're looking to fill a void that shouldn't be there in the first place. So, Ruth, Linda, thank you again for joining thank us. You. Thank you. All right, everyone, stay with us. Up next, we're going to take a quick look at your top news this evening, plus a look at your top sports headlines after this.